Hey guys, I'm back. Did you miss me? Because <laughs> I really missed you. I know it's been a really long time and you're probably wondering where I've been this whole time. And I gotta be honest with you. I have just been away from YouTube. As you probably know, I am a full-time software engineer, especially since joining Amazon. I have been very, very busy with my own personal life. I've went through multiple moves from New York to Boston, Boston to California. And when I got to California, I didn't really have my own place or my own studio to record. But luckily now I have my own place. I actually have my own room which has been a really big blessing where I could just really record and just be really, really comfortable. And I am so happy to finally start my channel. And I just want to give you some updates about where I am in my life. In terms of my professional career, I am now a senior front-end engineer. That is insane to me because when I did join, becoming a senior seems so far away, especially because at fan companies, those are really, really hard to get. The role that I got hired at is considered a terminal role. And what I mean by a terminal role is that you could actually stay at that position forever if you want to. The fact that I was able to get a senior role was a big, big accomplishment for me. And obviously came with a pay raise as well, which, you know what? Your boy is not going to complain at all. You know, in terms of my professional and my personal life, I feel like I've definitely been able to just kind of flourish a little bit. If you've been following my channel from the beginning, you know that I was pumping out content almost two times a week. And to be honest with you, I did what every person starting off new does, and I compared myself with my friends. As you probably already know, I've been blessed to have met so many amazing people through my YouTube journey, and people like Coding Phase, people like Chris Sean, all of these really great, great creators that I've been able to meet through YouTube have become my friends. And it is so cool to see them flourish and do so well. But at the same time, I found myself asking, why can't I have... The 50,000 subscribers? Why can I have the 100,000 subscribers? I felt like I was doing the right things. Maybe my content was just really, really boring. I don't know. And it just felt like if I kept doing the same thing over and over and over and over again, it wouldn't lead to the result that I was looking for. So I decided to take a step back and just focus on my own professional career and professional growth. Was this a good decision? Personally, for me, I think so, because I was able to really just enjoy my life as a developer being able to just really flourish with the type of salary that I was making. And I'll be honest, the salary is good. But now that I haven't been doing this for six to eight months, I've started to really miss you guys. And I really want to just start engaging with the community more. And this is why I'm back. I really want to come in with a bang. In terms of consistency and just overall, like what should you expect from this channel? I honestly cannot tell you and promise you that I'll be making one video a week or anything like that. But I do want to be a little bit more available to you in this channel and be more vulnerable with you. Because I think before my channel was all about giving professional advice, giving, I felt like that there was a barrier between my personality as Alex versus my brand as Tech Rally. Me as Tech Rally was always this person that was giving you coaching advice, how to break into tech and all those things. But I never really got to show you the side of me that was just pure Alex. And that's kind of what I want to do moving forward with this channel. I still want to keep the name Tech Rally because that is something that has always been my baby. And now I just can't ever let it go. But I also do want to show you my personal sites, my personal struggles, what my life is like as a developer at Amazon. People always ask me, why aren't you sharing moments or experiences at your time at Amazon? And I've always tried to keep that super separate. Moving forward, I do want to share some glimpse and just what it is really like being a software engineer at Amazon. It has been such a rewarding experience, but it's also been very difficult, especially now that I am a senior front-end engineer and it's still a learning curve for me as well, just being able to balance so many different things just outside of coding. So that's very a long-winded way of saying that I'm back. I do want to give you some updates about what I've been doing so far and what I plan on doing. I have a couple of collabs and courses that I think are going to be really, really helpful. And hopefully, you know, you find it helpful as well. I did miss you all. And I really hope that I could be more consistent. And yeah. Let's make 2024 a bang. Like how I end all my videos, keep building developers. Your time will come. Miss you guys. Bye.